When I was a kid, my dream was to be a journalist. So my friend Mike introduced me to his mom, who was a writer, and not just any writer, Doris Kearns Goodwin. Hello, Hi, you. Doris. Hi. <laughs> wow, this so is so good. So you've seen a lot of these pictures, right? Yes. So, oh, I remember yeah. all these. So <gasps> this is when I'm 24 as a White House fellow working with LBJ. <laughs> but I remember you would let me look. I remember you had a, you were just written, and you would let look, let us look at pages of it. Oh, wow. And, and I would think, she's writing a book, and this is how she's doing it. And I think it was Lincoln. Yes, it probably was. It would have been, yeah. This book was the one that mattered the most to me in some ways. I, don't, I mean, I don't know if you really understand. This was just so inspirational to me to be around you. And I yeah. remember thinking to myself, I got to get into this world. It just was such <laughs> I'm a... I'm so glad. No, yeah. I know it matters. When I went to Harvard to get my PhD, the head of the department said, you know, you women are taking the place of a man. Um, you're unlikely statistically to finish. But I remember the three of us just went out and had a drink. And we thought, we'll show him. Yeah. And we did. But you had it a little bit easier. But still, to see women doing things, it makes a huge difference. I remember sort of my mom telling me that, you know, when she was growing up, you could be a nurse, you could be a teacher. You know, and that was pretty much it. You, you could never be a journalist. I just think it's a great age to be a young woman and to be on this television as you are, now representing yourself to some young girl that's yeah. seeing you in high school and thinking, yeah, I can become like Katie. Yeah, well, you know, I, I have two daughters, and so when I do this job, I think about them all the time. You probably don't even remember the conversation we had, but it, it was a conversation that I needed at the time because I was probably 19 or 20 and thinking, what am I going to do with my life? Journalism was really just part of my whole sort of being. Right. But I never thought a girl could do it. And so when I met you and you were like, you can do it. And I thought, well, Doris Kearns Goodwin says <laughs> I can be a reporter, that I'm going to be a reporter. It just meant so much. Hooray. And you yeah. made it. Big, wow. big time. Awesome. I'm so proud of you. It's a dream. It's a dream come true to be back in Boston. Yeah. Thank you wow. so much, Doris. I just have to oh, say thank I, you. Well, I'm thrilled to know that. Yeah. I mean, to be a little part of that path to where you are is great.